Ah, let me warn the Nigerian police. It is a warning that as we are peaceful, if anything happens to any protestant, whether misfire, backfire, straight bullet, or even catalyst and shoot, Tinibu, the demand will be changed. And we are coming. And this is the time. We are not going back. We are here to change the narration of this country. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Enough of the keeping of quiet. Why are you quiet? You are hungry. You are quiet. What are you quiet about? Are you not paying? Nothing is working in this country. If you can crawl, crawl. If you can walk, walk. If you can run, run. Anything you do, keep protesting. Don't stop. So, what are the motives for this protest? Hunger. Just that. Hunger is the motive. Are you not hungry? See, let me be honest. Every one of you know the reason why we are here. So sometimes asking motive is, the, this is a hunger protest in regards to any bad government. And the, the hunger, insecurity, bad health care, bad government, bad road, bad educational sectors. So many things is just wrong. Bad leadership. We are tired of this now. And for the period we told them that we want to come out to come and protest and exercise our fundamental rights. There's no threat that use the state, that use the non-state, that use almost everything possible to stop it. But let me tell the Nigerian people that nobody can stop you. Nobody can stop an idea whose time has come. And this is the time for us to change the situation of this country. This is the time for us to make things right. This is the time for us to fight for our rights. This is the time for us to stand up as the giant of Africa and to demand for good government in this country. Now, the roads are bad. Farmer can't go to the farm to go and do anything because they need to take permission from bandits. Who does that in the nation? You can't take anybody on any emergency because there is no road. You can't do anything. And the government is not doing anything about this. The Nigerian is not, the government is not doing anything about it. That's why we are coming out to make the change and our demand is clear. Revert fair subsidy. Subsidy is for the rich, it's not for the poor. Subsidize our fuel. Let us be buying our fuel 100 naira per liter. And let us have policies that work for the people of Nigeria. It is not for anybody, but for the people of Nigeria. The son of nobody have nothing to eat. The son of nobody is thinking of possibly a way to commit suicide because he can't afford any means. He can't do anything. I'm advising and encouraging every one of you that thought the protests were postponed. Look at us on the street of Abuja. We are here. No protests were postponed. We are hitting the street. And we are here to demand for our fundamental right. And this right and our demand must be made or we are not leaving the street. We are not negotiating that with anybody.